Hello friends! Today you'll see how actors of the movie The Goonies have changed. You'll know their original names and age. I will show you how they looked then in 1985 and what with them now in 2020. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! Michael Walsh or Mikey is the de facto leader of the Goonies. He is asthmatic and never goes anywhere without his inhaler. When Mikey was younger, his father used to tell him various stories of grand adventure, including the story of One-Eyed Willie. Mikey is ported by actor Sean Austin. This was Austin's first film role. Lawrence Cohen or Chunk, Jeff Cohen, is the member of the Goonies. He's a chronic liar and has a penchant for eating. His signature dance is the Truffle Shuffle where he pulls his shirt up and wiggles in place while making a number of ridiculous and embarrassing noises. Chunk can tell the flavor of ice cream by smelling it. Andrea Carmichael, she is played by Carrie Green, often shortened to Andy, is a cheerleader for her high school. Andy has long wavy red hair and green eyes. She is romantically involved with Brent. She is eager to spend a long time with him and attempts to find ways to kiss him. During the night she spends with him and the Goonies. Sloth is a member of the Fratelli family. He is very tall, has distorted features. He is seen with only a couple of teeth and his eyes are slanted. This is the reason why Chunk was initially afraid of him. Sloth is the first seen chained in a room being tortured by Jake's terrible singing. He's played by football star John Matuchak. Richard Wan or Data, Ki Hoi Kwan, is the member of the Goonies. Data share an interest in inventing. He's the youngest and shortest of the Goonies. He's Chinese and has short black hair. Most notable is his chest plate and belt, which he has hooked up to multiple inventions, making him a lot like a walking multitude. Clark Devereaux, or Mao, Corey Feldman, is a member of the Goonies. He's constantly told to shut up by his friends, whether due to his poor taste in humor or his inability to stop talking. Mao has a strained friendship with Steph. Jeff Cohen initially tried out for the role before instead landing one as Chunk. Jake Fratelli, Robert Davy, is the member of the Fratellis. Jake has been arrested and is behind held in Clatsop County Jail. During lunch one day, he tricks a prison guard into thinking he's committed suicide, knocks him unconscious and escapes. With his brother and mother's help, they drive off chased by the Astoria police. Stephanie Steinbrenner, or Steph, is blonde. She wears a pair of glasses and mismatched fishing lure-inspired earrings. Her friendship with Mouth is a love-hate kind of thing. Stephanie was ported by actress Martha Plimpton, who was cast in tomboyish roles in film at the time. She describes Steph as kind of a punk nerd. Francis Fratelli, Joe Pantoliano, is a member of the Fratelli family. He wears a toupee to cover his belt spot, as well as a pair of glasses. Also, he wears a holster strap for his gun. Helping break his brother out of county jail, Francis pours a tank of gasoline around the jailhouse and lights it up with a shot from his pistol. Mama Fratelli is the leader of the Fratelli criminal family. She's the middle-aged woman. Mama Fratelli helped me her son escape from county jail. In the scenes where she and Jake argue and she slaps him, the slaps are real. Richard Donner instructed Ramsey to hit Robert Davy as hard as she could. Mama is played by Anne Ramsey. Rosalita is the housemaid hired by Iron Walsh. Rosalita is the middle-aged, short woman with dark brown hair. She wears a flowery scarf over her head and a grey raincoat. She only speaks Spanish and Mouth helps translate, although translating wrong information to her. Rosalita is supported by actress Luke Ontiveros. 
Irene Walsh, Mary Ellen Trainer, is Erin Walsh's wife and the mother to Mikey and Brand. Irene off screen injured her arm, requiring her to have it in a sling for a speedy recovery. Unable to pack for the move by herself, she hires a housemaid, Rosalita, to accompany her around town and prepare everything for the next day. Mr. Elton Perkins is the richest man in Astoria, Oregon. He is Troy's father. Mr. Perkins plans to acquire the Goon Dogs to turn the area into a golf course for the Astoria Country Club. He attempts to visit the Walsh residence to see Erin Walsh about this, but leaves when he isn't home. He's played by Curtis Hansen. Troy Perkins lives in the hillside district of Astoria and looks down on those who live in the Goon Dogs. Troy is dismayed to learn that the Goonies manages to save their house from foreclosure. Troy is portrayed by actor Steve Antin. Although Troy is 16, in the movie Steve Antin was 27 years old when the Goonies was released. Data's father, Michael Paul Chan, is an inventor. He lives in the Goon Dogs with his wife and son, Richard Wang. Data's father appears at the end when he is reunited with his son. He opens his jacket to reveal an invention involving a disposable camera, which he attempts to use to photograph his family. It fails, however. Troy Friend is the boy Troy Perkins, friends with from school. He lives in the hillside district of Astoria. He wears a red sweater over a light-colored shirt and pockets. He teases Troy about his involvement with Andy, and Troy reveals he plans to sleep with her. The blonde friend was ported by Jeb Adams, his realtor. The Sheriff is the sheriff of Astoria's Clatsop County Jail. The sheriff has had previous run-ins with Chunk, who had prank called him multiple times one of which leading to a wild goose chase involving a supposed terrorist hostage crisis at all Sizzler restaurants in the area. The sheriff is portrayed by actor Paul Twer. Brandon Walsh is played by George Brolin. Often shortened to Brand, is the member of the Goonies. He lives in the Goon Dogs of Astoria. Brand is tall and muscular from his interest in working out. Prior to the day the events of the movie take place, Brand has scheduled a date with his crush Andy. This was Brolin's first film role. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course subscribe to the channel.